What's up Court Crew and welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Courtney Janine and I'm back with another video. In today's video I'm going to be doing yet another Converti cap lookbook. I really enjoyed doing my first one. If you haven't seen my first one I will have it linked down below. This one that I'm wearing is one of the ones that I showcased in that first video. So if you would like to know the deets on this hair then definitely check that video out. Today we are going to be reviewing and trying on and styling two new Converti caps. I like to do at least two Converti caps because I feel like then you're able to see you know different textures you're also able to see um different colors and lastly able to see different styles because based on the length that you choose or based on the units that you choose you can definitely get more looks i think you can get more looks from longer units but also you can still get a couple of styles out of shorter units as well so if you would like to see how i style my converti cap by outre then definitely keep watching before we get into it if this is your first time seeing me here on the yt hey girl hey my name is courtney janine i do beauty and mostly hair on this channel but if you are interested in more lifestyle content, I did just start a, a new channel called Keeping Up With Courtney. It is a lifestyle channel where I'll be doing vlogs, challenges, mukbangs, hauls, like the whole nine over there, routine videos. So if you're interested in that, I will have it up in the cards, description, and in the pinned comment. And yeah, you guys, let's get into today's video. All right, you guys, so first things first, let's talk about the two units I'll be talking about today. The first one is a recommendation that I got from Is That Your Hair. I follow her on TikTok, and she always is wearing this beautiful wig which turned out to be Outre Converti Cap Curls Trip. I picked it out in the color one. I honestly would have gotten it in a number two just because I feel like that's the most natural looking color for my natural hair. But this was the only one that was in stock. So I think it's is that your hair who got this one um, out of stock. But yeah, I picked it up in number one because that was the only color. And then I also picked up Sway Saray. This is one that I've been wanting to try. But honestly, there was never any natural colors in stock. And I I could not wait any longer so I just got DR chocolate cream I do like this color so we'll see what it looks like especially with the headband wig it does have that DR so that dark root so it should blend seamlessly but we will see when we try her on so I think I'm gonna do sway soiree first so I'm going to take off this unit and then I'm gonna show you guys how I prep my hair for a half wig install hey guys so underneath my half wigs i always like to have on a wig cap this just protects my hair the wig i like to push it a little bit back next thing i like to do is make sure that my edges are slicked down i just feel like that makes it to look a lot more natural if you're not new to my channel then you know i've been talking about this um edge control for a while but this is the gummy professional styling wax ultra hold i do have it in my amazon storefront so i will have it linked down below if you're interested but well i have 4c hair and this is literally the only edge control that i can say that has really say has left my um edges on for a whole day like usually i will have to reapply my edges with this one sometimes i do too um if i don't like you know put enough but if i do girl these will stay on for hours and i have real 4c hair not that fake 4c okay so i'm just going to swoop these really quickly and then i will be back so you guys doing your edges is definitely a optional step you do not have to do this if you do not want to but this is just something that i like to do with my half wigs now opening the first one up this is sway soiree again i got it in dr chocolate cream this was actually the only color available for this unit as well so you know slim pickings i would have definitely loved a natural color with this one just because it is a really natural length and super um pretty curl pattern so this is what the wig looks like as you can see it does have a dark root but it's very very like it's not that much so i'm not sure if this is going to be something that you know my um headband will cover that's what i'm nervous about but let's go ahead and cut it and try it on and if you're not familiar with the converti cap collection this is from outre it is essentially a halfway collection but has so many different compartments that make it easy for you to get a number of styles out of it does have a drawstring so you're able to really scrunch it in if you would like to do a ponytail you can also leave out some of your hair you can wear it as a headband or you can cut bangs to some of them and make it into a full wig so i'm just going to 
this on my head. Uh, make sure it fits snug using that drawstring. And we're gonna see what it looks like straight out the pack. All right, so this is the hair straight out the pack. I definitely feel like I need to like, I don't think I wanna brush it, so to say, but I definitely want to just play with it a little bit. But just looking at this, unit i'm definitely getting like oh i should have got this in a natural color but again i was not able to all right you guys so this is the hair just a little bit scrunched out i'm about to put my headband back on but i think that this is absolutely gorgeous i wish i was able to get it in a 1b or a 2 or even a 1 um but i do really like this color it's just that i just have a feeling that when i put on this headband the dark root is going to disappear and I don't know how natural this is gonna look but I'm going to put on the hairband and see what it's giving. Mm -hmm. oh, that's nuts, Bitch, when I'm up in the function, Johnny Dang on a chain, it's custom. Walk through when I'm looking like a hottie little baby woman, Nash with the body, it's busting. This dress look good, cause I'm in it. Big body range, rope when I was winning. I'm in my bag, I'm in my trophy. Trip done in Prada, shoes is just sexy. Big stomp, big money, big pressure. I stomp on hoes, no pepper. Yeah, man, on my DM, you should leave him. When I ask about his girl, he don't be all right you guys so this is sway soray i have some thoughts so let's go ahead and get into what i love about this unit and just to give you guys a little bit more of an overview of what this unit is okay so this is a synthetic bob wavy style it is it doesn't say the the length but i would say about 12 inches and this is so pretty and the a brief overview about the converted cap collection if you are new is that it is all about limitless styling possibilities like i mentioned before this unit is so versatile and not just this unit but honestly any of the units from the converted cap collection what i love about this collection is that you can wear it as a headband unit you can wear it as a half wig with leave out you can wear it as a ponytail you can get so many styles out of this unit which i love and i absolutely love how many different textures lengths these units come in because i just think that that really adds to the collection as a whole there is a style for everyone i've said this so many times but honestly each of the units come with a whole little booklet that features all of the well not even all some of the units and there's so many different styles which i love and that's why i kind of created this sort of series or look book series with these units because this is a collection that I feel like you can get a lot of versatility out of. Reveal your own hairline for a realistic look that kind of plays into the limitless styling possibilities. Breathable and flexible cap that lays flat. Yes and I absolutely love that. This cap lays flawlessly. I feel like a lot of times with half wigs they can get very bulky and even when I have a headband unit that is a headband wig it can get bulky because most of the time it comes with an attached headband and then I'm trying to like put a headband over it and then it just looks bulky so i love that it lays flat adjustable drawstring for a custom fit yes this allows it to this allows you to really customize the fit but also it can be used to make it into a ponytail which i love and then premium synthetic fibers yes i feel like this hair is really soft to the touch um not getting too much tangling this is you know um not haven't worn it for long but i can kind of tell when a unit will tangle up and this unit just looks so much more natural the more you fluff it out so i love that that. This unit comes in a number of colors. I picked it up in chocolate cream, but I honestly, after seeing it on, this is another like everyday unit for me. So I will want to pick it up in DR Chocolate Swirl and just a number two. So I'm going to be stalking the wig sites to see whenever this comes back in stock. But it comes in chocolate swirl, cinnamon wine, ginger brown, golden amber, and tiramisu, as well as your natural colors like 1, 1B, and 2. So I absolutely love this unit. Like I mentioned before, this is a unit that I feel like will look the best with, um, um, a headband like this um or with some of your hair out for more styling possibilities but honestly in terms of like what you can do i don't really see myself putting some up and some down um i would just kind of like it to be like a flip over um and just straight to the back so not too much styling versatility with this but i think that if you did wear it as a with some of your hair out you could definitely get more um looks with this so that's my thoughts on this one let's try on curls trip next I'm 
So here is Miss Carl's trip and I do have some thoughts. Let's get into it But first let's get the specs on this unit. This unit is synthetic of course a layered curly style It's a medium length and it's natural yucky texture This is from the same collection the Converti cap collection from Altrice So similar key features so we won't go through those again, but they do have different specialty colors for this unit this unit comes in ft 1b 30 dragon fruit dr2 golden amber dr chai latte dr ginger toffee and dr honey auburn um so a lot of different colors that you can get this unit in this is a one so i can definitely tell in person that there is a slight difference between my natural hair and this color but honestly it's not as bad as like i think with my last converted cap lookbook i did a number four and that one was like completely off so i think it's best to go to a one instead of a four but my perfect 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 color would definitely be a two um but that wasn't available for this unit anyways in terms of my thoughts on this unit like you saw in the styling portion i definitely feel like longer converted caps get a lot more styles out of them just because there's more length so you can do the uh, half up half down you can do the flip over like all the units so i just think that the longer unit do have more styles available um like styling options in terms of wearing it as a half wig or a headband wig but all in all i definitely really like this out of the two i prefer a sway soiree um just because i feel like that unit looks super natural i wish i was able to get it in a natural color so again i will be stocking the sites for that unit to come back in a natural color because i feel like that's going to be my everyday sort of unit i could definitely see myself even cutting bangs into that unit if i wanted to but i probably would just wear it as a headband unit honestly that's kind of been my vibe these days all in all you guys let me know down in the comments if you like these sort of lookbooks i've been really enjoying making them for you guys so make sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below which converted cap unit you have tried before it doesn't have to be any of the ones that i've tried but just let me know your fave down in the comments and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys